freedom. Just dropped the kids off at daycare early because I need some mommy time because they were driving me crazy last week. <sighs> so I put them in daycare early. Now I get to relax and read my book, China Study, and watch YouTube and do all that fun stuff before I go to work tonight. I have some stuff. I couldn't finish my koodles last night. So it's mostly sauce. And I'm going, I'm going, I could get it open. Ugh, I'm going to show you, hold on. It's all soupy. I got a lot of sauce left. So I'm going to um, spiralize some more cucumber that I had left over. And I might chop up some red peppers and tomatoes and and yeah that might be it to stick in there and I'm gonna take this for my dinner uh, to work tonight so here I'm going with this half a cucumber I had left and this will be the fourth night in a row that I've had koodles for dinner and other than the little bit of regular spaghetti that I tasted a few bites last night when I was making it for the family. Other than that, I've been all raw. This will be four days. Today will be four days. Um, I'm going to have... I haven't had breakfast yet. So far I've had um, lemon ginger water with some stevia. And... I'm thinking about, I think I'm going to crack open this watermelon. I forgot to tell you guys my Costco haul that I did buy a watermelon also. So I think I'm going to crack open this watermelon and eat half of it. And that, actually I'll probably eat the whole thing. I'll probably eat half of it for breakfast and I'll take the other half for my lunch. And this will be my dinner at work. And I'll show you what it looks like after I finish chopping all the uh, red pepper. And if I decide if I'm going to put anything else in it other than cherry tomatoes. I saw this video on how to chop a red pepper. And so I finally figured out how to chop it without having to get seeds everywhere. You chop from the bottom and you go around the side. So then everything comes off like perfectly. No seeds to wash out of my pepper. That's pretty awesome. Now I'm going to dice those up. All right, so bam, there's my dinner all prepared. Yummy. Yummy, yummy. Probably doesn't look that big to you all, but it'll fill me up. And now I'm going to make my watermelon juice. Oh man, that looks like a really juicy, sweet watermelon. Yum. Can't wait to dig into that. I'm going to um, juice it and put, not juice it, but put it in my blender and add some ginger cubes to it, probably three. So I'm going to make watermelon smoothie with three ginger cubes. Because I make uh, water in the morning that just fills up a blender bottle and I use two cubes and it's really not that spicy so I'm going to add an extra one. Plus I need it for the anti-inflammatory benefits. I was going to put greens in there but now I'm like second guessing myself because I really don't want to have a stomach ache. So I think I'm going to skip it. There's my first batch. Here it goes in my 60 ounce clean canteen. It's probably going to be more than what fits in here. Just by a little bit. But hey, that means I get to drink the excess. Mmm. Mmm. Super delicious. If you never tried it with the ginger, give it a try. Mm. It's really good. Um, yeah, so that's my breakfast, my lunch, and my dinner. And now, I'm after I'm finished, I'm going to clean up my freaking mess because I made a watermelon mess. And then I'm going to try really hard to concentrate on reading my China study book. Of course, after I upload this video for you guys. So... That's pretty much my day since I got to go to work, so. Oh, I just remembered that lime is super delicious in watermelon smoothies, so. I'm going to add a lime in my smoothies also. Yeah, the other ones are really hard. This one's kind of hard, but I think I can get some juice out of there. Just got to squish it a little bit. 
So yeah, I'm gonna add that to my smoothies and that's it. Hope everyone has a great day. Thanks for joining me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and share with your friends. Thanks so much. I decided to make some taco rice for my family since I won't be here tonight. So short brown, short green brown rice, black beans, tomatoes, a packet of mild taco seasoning, some black pepper, I'm probably going to add some red pepper. Um, I usually add a lot of extra taco seasoning, but I ran out of the uh, large container from Costco that I have. Actually, actually, I have bought a, a package of Organic Frontier taco seasoning from uh, Amazon, and it was a large package, but I used to make this very often, so I already ran out of that stuff. I need to get some more. Anyway, so... Just because I'm cooking for my family doesn't mean I can't eat raw, right? So tonight I have koodles and my family has this. And they will enjoy it because I know it's one of their favorites. <laughs> <laughs> Na -na 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 -na. <laughs>